General Motors is one of the companies at the forefront of what has become a revolution in the electric vehicle industry. GM is already offering the lowest priced EV on the market, with the Chevy Bolt EV starting at $26,500, but it isn't stopping there. Now the company is looking to bring competition to the pickup market and go head-to-head -head with the Ford Maverick with the launch of a new $25,000 compact pickup truck. Join us as we take a look at this upcoming compact pickup truck by GM and how it might be better than the Ford Maverick. But before we go into details, let's look at GM's venture into the EV truck market. It all started in 2016 when General Motors announced that they were planning to launch an all-electric truck. At the time, electric trucks were still a relatively new concept, and many were still very skeptical about the idea. But General Motors was sure that electric trucks had a bright future, and the company was determined to make it a reality. Fast forward to 2019, General Motors revealed its first electric truck, the GMC Hummer EV. It was a revolutionary design that was unlike anything else on the market. The Hummer EV boasted a range of over 400 miles and could accelerate from 0 to 60 miles per hour in only 3 seconds. It was also the first electric truck to offer features such as adaptive air suspension, a zero-emission powertrain, and a unique Infinity sound system. The Hummer EV was well-received by the public, and it quickly became a symbol of the potential of electric trucks. In the years since its release, General Motors has continued to develop and refine its electric truck designs, with one of the most recent being the GMC Hummer EV3X. This vehicle is even more impressive than the original, boasting a range of up to 500 miles, a 0 to 60 time of only 2.9 seconds, and a host of other features, such as a supercharged 6.2L V8 engine and a driver assist system. The success of the GMC Hummer EV has paved the way for other electric trucks to enter the market. Companies such as Tesla, Rivian, and Bollinger have all unveiled their own electric truck designs, and now it looks like EV trucks are here to stay. Now, when it comes to compact pickup trucks, the Ford Maverick is the truck to beat, and we might have a challenger on our hands now. GM unveiled a compact electric concept pickup truck earlier last year during a media event held behind closed doors. The event was hosted in the automaker's affordable EV design studio in Warren, Michigan, which is highly invested in affordable EVs. This truck will reportedly cost less than $25,000. This announcement that GM is looking into making a compact electric pickup truck comes after the success of Ford and Hyundai's small truck lineups. According to Automotive News, Ford sold 74,370 Mavericks in 2022, while Hyundai sold 36,480 Santa Cruz models. In the first year of manufacturing the Maverick, Ford was completely sold out in a matter of months. For many people, purchasing an electric truck, or any truck, for more than $100,000 is simply out of the question. So this new EV truck will definitely turn some heads at the proposed price. To develop the truck's design, the company will reportedly take customer feedback into consideration. Michael Pevivar, director of affordable EV and crossover design at Chevy, told Automotive News that the company is experimenting to see what appeals to customers and what doesn't. The executive also said that when designing and engineering affordable EVs, General Motors intends to extensively depend on customer feedback. This compact truck is only one of several affordable EVs that the automaker is considering developing. GM started with a bed length of 4 to 4.5 feet for this truck but is willing to adjust it. Pevivar told Auto News that the input may come back that it's just too small, and that's okay. He also said, we're creating these to get a reaction and then to try to modify it or move on. What does work? What doesn't work? What's expected? Affordability is the key portion of this, and there's lots of different ways to approach it. General Motors can experiment with the sizes and shapes of new models without having to start from scratch each time, thanks to the crazily versatile Ultium EV platform. That saves time, but more importantly, it saves money, allowing GM to theoretically reach the mythical $25,000 EV mark. The GMC Hummer EV, Cadillac Lyric, and the future Chevrolet Equinox EV are just a few of the EVs in GM's lineup that are supported by this design. According to Pevivar, some buyers may find the truck too tiny, and if that's the feedback from customers, GM could increase the truck's size by switching to a different architecture. 
The platform is based on a modular battery system that allows different battery configurations to be used in a wide range of vehicles. This will enable automakers to quickly and easily switch between different types of vehicles and battery configurations. The platform also features a range of advanced technologies, including a powerful electric motor, advanced driver assistance systems, and an advanced infotainment system. The Ultium platform is designed to be highly efficient, allowing for better range and performance. It also provides for the integration of cutting-edge technologies, such as wireless charging and over-the-air software updates. GM is also developing a range of new features, including a new battery, improved safety features, and the ability to link up with other vehicles for improved performance. The Ultium EV platform is a significant step forward for GM and the automotive industry as a whole. It has the power to revolutionize the way electric vehicles are built and sold, and it will help to reduce emissions and improve the sustainability of transportation. The automaker did not reveal a lot about the specs of the vehicle, but it is expected to feature a suite of advanced safety and infotainment systems, allowing for a safer and more enjoyable driving experience. Additionally, the truck will be equipped with a range of connectivity features, allowing for seamless integration with other devices and services. Also, because it's an EV, we can expect it to have a quicker 0 to 60 mile per hour time than the Maverick's 7.7 seconds. There's the argument, though, that it'll take a lot of work for this new truck to displace the Ford Maverick, as many consumers prefer hybrid trucks to fully electric trucks. The main advantage of fully electric trucks is that they provide zero emissions. This is beneficial for the environment because electric trucks do not release any pollutants into the atmosphere. But do people really care about that? There are people that believe that GM should make this new truck a hybrid vehicle because most fully electric trucks lose a considerable chunk of their range when towing. And what's the use of a truck that can't tow comfortably? Take a look at this comment. I don't want an EV truck. EV trucks can't tow without losing about two-thirds of their range, so they can't do what a truck is supposed to do. I do want a plug-in hybrid truck with a battery range large enough for daily commuting, 50 to 60 miles, but also has a gas engine for long-range trips and towing. They would sell like hotcakes. If a PHEV truck can't be done cheaply, then a small four-door truck with an efficient four-cylinder turbo engine similar to the Maverick is the way to go. This seems like a no-brainer. With battery technology right now, EV trucks are just stupid and so are the people who buy them. Before we round off, tell us in the comments section if you agree with this. One selling point that EVs have, though, is that the cost of electricity is much lower than the cost of gasoline, making fully electric trucks more cost-effective to operate. But, of course, we'll have to wait and see how the public receives this vehicle when it eventually launches and how well it sells compared to the Ford Maverick. One thing is for sure, though. This new electric truck will signal a significant step forward for GM, as it's the first two-door compact electric pickup truck available on the market. This means that more people will have access to a more efficient, economical, and sustainable way of transportation. What do you think about this vehicle? Let us know down in the comments section. If you've watched until now, thank you very much. Please consider subscribing to Velocity for more videos about EVs, Tesla, Ford, and the latest car news.